Hey guys, so we are headed to the store really quick because I need to get a few things and I've been kind of cleaning like crazy all morning. Like I said, um, uh, we have somebody coming in today and I can't buckle my seatbelt um, at like 5.30 so I have to kind of clean everything up for that and it sucks because the people that are coming are coming like, well, I guess our situation is kind of different, but I just wish people would come like all at the same time so I wouldn't have to like deep clean like over and over again because it's so hard to keep my house clean. But um, so I'm gonna be doing that all day and kind of trying to pack up some things too, just to get some things out of our hair um, and stuff like that. So yeah, that is what today is going to pretty much be all about. And um, did I say I'm gonna stop at the car wash first? I'm gonna stop at the car wash because my car's really dirty, like really dirty. I don't know how it got so dirty. And um, that's pretty much it. It's nicer today, it's not snowing. It's 44 degrees, which is better. Um, and I still need to get maternity tank tops because I am wearing leggings again. And all my tank tops, like they cover my butt. Like I hate, and I know like a lot of people hate this, but I still don't understand why people wear leggings as pants. Like I don't understand. It's like everybody knows that leggings aren't pants. So why do people wear leggings as pants? Like you have to wear a shirt that covers your butt. And even if my shirt like covers my butt, but it's still kind of short, I still feel like self-conscious, you know what I mean? So I just need to get some tank tops because now that I'm starting to show a little bit, all my tank tops are shorter. We're going through the car wash. We're going through the car wash. There's Ursula's tentacles. Is that Ursula? I used to always say that these ones right here, like the big um, ones that go across, we're Ursula from Little Mermaid and we were go going underneath her tentacles. I don't know why, but that's always what I would say. But I was like scared to death of car washes when I was little. And I have this other really weird irrational fear that while I'm paying for my, um, for them to, you know, wash my car, my window's down. And I always think the guy that's spraying my car is going to like not remember that the window's down and then totally spray inside my car. Like I think that every single time and I always get really nervous. And then I also talked about in a past vlog how I was always afraid that the blowers at the end of the um, car wash are gonna bust my windows in. I'm always terrified that they're gonna bust my windows in. Like I always think that's gonna happen. All right, you guys, so I just got out of Target and I think I've talked about this in past vlogs, but my biggest pet peeve ever I feel like my screen is dirty is when people are rude to really nice people especially old people I get so pissed and I literally want to slap them like the guy that um, checked me out was like this older guy he was probably like 70s I would imagine and he was so cute and so nice and he was super cheerful and he was just talking and being really nice and he was older and I think old people are just adorable anyways and this lady in front of me he was like trying to talk to her and she was just like straight up ignoring him like completely ignoring him and being like the hugest bitch and I literally wanted to slap her and be like be nice anyways yeah I just get so frustrated when people are rude for no reason I think it's so mean especially when somebody is being really nice to you I think it's just so mean and I don't understand why people do that like I just feel so bad so when I went through I was really really nice to him all right so I bought some new prenatals these are one a day prenatals and so I only have to take one per day so one tablet and one liquid gel so these freaking better last me a long time because those seem tiny don't you think so you guys are gonna think I'm like crazy for doing this because you guys know I don't like EOS lip balms um, they just aren't my favorite lip balms at all but when I was younger, me and my friend Jessica, we always would use um, Bon Bell. Was it Bon? Bonnie? Bon? No, not Bon Bell. Lip Smackers. And our favorite one was the blueberry one. And we used to use that blueberry chapstick all the time. And that smell is so nostalgic to me because we would use that stuff all the time. And they don't sell blueberry lip smackers anymore, which is totally stupid. And I remember when they came out with um, Alice in Wonderland collection of EOS lip balms. And I looked everywhere for that because I knew that they had a blueberry lip balm in there. And I couldn't find it anywhere, so I never bought it. 
but they came out with a blueberry Akai EOS lip balm, and I want to smell this to see if it's going to bring back memories or if it's going to smell at all like the Lip Smackers one, because, yeah, I'm dying to find a chapstick that smells like that. Mm, it's pretty close. And I have to say, this one is a lot better than my other one. I got the red one a long time ago, and that one sucked. Like, I felt like it didn't moisturize my lips at all. But this one is, like, way better and way more moisturizing than that other one that I had that I hated. And it actually smells a little bit like the Lip Smackers one. Hey, monkey. What did you just have to eat? What did you just eat? Cheesies? So our house is all clean. Let's see how long this will last. With this little boy in the house. <laughs> Give daddy a big hug. Big you hug, haven't seen him all day. Give him a kiss. Give him a kiss. Oh. We're gonna go see Kevin and Kelly. You can see Uncle Kevin and Kittler. You and dance. Wee. She wants to climb your legs. Oh, you want to climb my leg? No. What do you want to do? You can dance like this? No. <coughs> I don't know what you want. Tell daddy what you want. Oh, you want to dance like this? No. No? You just want to hold his hands? Elena, I have your water over here. I have all my lamps on to make it look all cozy and homey in here. What you eating? What is it? Sucker. Yeah. It's a lollipop. Can you say lollipop? Is it numbers? Yes. Yeah, you like it a lot. Are you going to be hyped up on sugar? Daddy's got a Sour. apple. And I have a cherry. And we just found these, Kara did. Yeah, we bought them a long time ago. It was our coast trip. Was it? No, it wasn't. We bought these. When did we buy these? I thought we were going over the pass or something. Why can't I remember? The last time I thought we went over the, was the- I think it was just driving from Redmond to Bend. You stopped to get like a something and then I said get me some candy and you got like tons of candy. <laughs> You look like you're really enjoying that sucker. It's yummy. <laughs> Are you okay, holding have baby you Peyton? We have a, Can you hold her hand? Man? No. Can you hold I her hand? I've seen some from you, you know what? the boxes at your house. Oh. Elena, you're going to play a Little Mermaid with her, huh? Can you give her a kiss? Back here, oh. That's really nice of you. Okay, it's done. Where's this? Yes. You don't get any. Mm. Tomatoes. Ew, sick. Whatever. Sick. Clean. Mm. Serious effort. <laughs> well, which one's yours, Look at Peyton? Her face. So She's cute. cute. I want the biggest burger in there. <laughs> Watching getting the massive bites and it not be anybody else's cats is a problem. Are you rolling on Harold? No. 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 No